Wait a minute. This is Florida. Good morning, 4.43 a.m. Time to get ready for work. Bag is packed. I have 19 minutes to get downstairs before the van. I figured I'd do a quick good morning before I run downstairs. Two legs today, like I said in the other vlogs, we were doing San Diego to Washington, D.C. Three hour sit and then Washington, D.C. to Tampa. Flying in the front still, forward galley, so first class meals. I'll have two full meal services today, I think. I don't remember actually if we do meals from D.C. to Tampa, but for sure San Diego to D.C. will have meals. It's actually also mine and John's fifth wedding anniversary. How crazy is that? I cannot believe we've been married for five whole years. We've done so much in the last five years. It's crazy. We've literally traveled the world together. We've had a CNN article written about us. Like we've accomplished a lot in five years. So I'm excited for the next five. So happy anniversary, John. Hopefully we'll get to celebrate tomorrow on our day off or sometime this week. We'll figure out a day. I got to run downstairs now though, because the van is leaving in 15 minutes and I cannot be late, but I just wanted to check in, say good morning. Also, my wings broke, so I don't have wings on today, which is kind of embarrassing. I don't know what happened, like the back totally fell off yesterday on the way to San Diego, and no one on my crew had an extra pair. So, gotta suffer through without a wing today. No bueno. I'm definitely drinking a liquid IV today. <laughs> this is a requirement. just got to DC, I went down to the crew room, had some lunch, worked on our bids. We are at the plane now, working this last leg to Tampa. We do have a meal service on this leg. Apparently though, starting January 1st, they're not gonna be doing meals on this leg, which is really interesting, I'm surprised about that. I didn't really get a chance to vlog much today because we're not allowed to like, I can't like vlog in the crew room, I would get in trouble for that, definitely. So I just wanted to check in and say hi. <sighs> last leg, it's gonna be like, I think under two hours, so we should be home pretty quick. We are flying on the 737 at 9 so we will have a full first class. We'll have 20 people up here in first with a full meal service. So hopefully the flight should go by pretty quickly. I mean, I think it should. Once I get home, I have something super exciting to show you because I'm becoming a dual citizen. Comment down below where you think I got my second passport from and I will buy you coffee if you get it correctly. The first person to get it correctly, not everybody. But yeah, I just wanted to check in and say hello. I haven't really vlogged today, so I'm sure this vlog is already super short. So I'm trying to stretch it out a little bit for y'all. Today was a very busy day. I wanted to vlog more on this sit, but we just got so carried away uh, with bidding and everything downstairs. And then, you know, I had lunch with the crew. I met two really cool ladies down in the crew room. One of them lives in Tampa and is based in Washington, D.C. And we were talking about Jimmy Buffett. She loves Jimmy Buffett too. So we talked about that for a while. And then another lady, she just moved to Tampa six days ago and she's actually gonna be on our flight. So I was telling her a little bit about the base, how the flying is, the cruise and everything. She's super nice. I'm super excited that she's in Tampa. Yeah, it was a good sit. We're gonna get ready to start boarding now. It is, what time is it? 5.02, departures in an hour and three minutes. And then I think we land around like 8.30 before nine o'clock. So we should get home pretty early. Tomorrow's gonna be a really fun day too because Sean and I are going out for an anniversary and we're going to like this little Christmas pop-up bar. So make sure you stay tuned for that. I'm gonna go get my galley set up. Catering just finished everything. So I will see y'all when we get to Tampa. Also, sorry I was talking so quickly. I was trying to get everything out before the pilots get here because they're gonna be coming right by me any minute. My crew probably thinks I'm crazy. They're like, who is he talking to up there? A few moments later. Holy moly, we're home. We made it home, finally. It was so good to be home. Two hours, 20 minutes later. Super good flight. Everyone was very, very nice. I have not had that many nice passengers in so long. I'm so tired. I can't wait to go home. My camera battery's dying, so that's fun. Oh, I'm sorry for making you yawn. I had a really good crew today. Uh, we had some flight attendants non revving They were all super nice. We got so many gifts, like insane amount of gifts today. We got popcorn, gift cards. What else? We got something else. Oh, little like chocolate chocolate cocoa things from Brussels. We got some kind of like pudding thing from Brussels. So many good gifts. It was so awesome. <sighs> so John and I are gonna drive home now. I cannot wait to go home and take a shower. My pajamas on, <laughs> relax. This was a good trip though. I really can't complain. I mean, all I did on this trip was relax. So I mean, it's a win-win. But yeah, I'm excited to be home. We're off the next few days. Tomorrow's gonna be a fun day. Going out to dinner with John to celebrate and then going to the Christmas pop-up bar. Can't wait to take you guys along, but <sighs> let's go home. I am 
home now and as promised, I told you I would show you guys the passport that I got. I'm trying to talk quietly because John is on a Zoom meeting over in the other room. I know it's like so late, but I don't want to be too loud but I am officially a dual citizen. Kind of. I kind of played a little bit of a prank on y'all. So I actually got a Key West passport. How crazy is that? Since Key West became its like own little territory thing in 1980s or like 1983, for a brief period, you can actually get a passport for the Conch Republic. So I did while we were in the Keys. So I think it's funny to have two of them. So yes, a quick little Vlogmas joke for all of you, but this is so funny. It looks so real. I would love to show you the inside, but I honestly can't because it really does have all of my personal information inside of it, which makes it even crazier. But it is really a cute little passport, Conch Republic. It has a ship, the flag, the dolphins, same flag as I have on my wall over here. Let me see if I can show you like anything has the little spot for like visas okay i could show you this it's like signed by the guy from key west it expires in 2029 it was issued december 8th 2023 yes there she is it's a little bit bigger than my normal passport i think oh no same size that's my little vlogmas prank slash joke for all of you that's just my fun little joke for you guys tonight it feels so good to be home i'm literally so happy to sleep in my own bed tonight gonna have a relaxing night i'm gonna edit vlogmas watch the taylor Swift Eros tour that came out today and just have a good night. I just started editing tomorrow's vlog mess. We're only two minutes in. Oh, I need to get my butt in gear. All right, let's do this. Got Vlogmas going here. Taylor Swift up here. Not John watching the Eras tour. Yeah. You love her. Oh, yeah. You do like Taylor. Oh my gosh, I am so mad right now. Like, literally so mad. So I'm editing tomorrow's video for Vlogmas and I realized that my microphone was turned off for the entire second half of the video. So I just inserted a montage. I'm so sorry about that. I'm so... Ugh, irritated that I did that. I cannot even believe that I did that. But you know what I say, it wouldn't be Vlogmas without something going wrong. Chalk it up to another thing that happened this year. Hello. Hi. What are you doing? Bedtime. You're tired? You mean you don't want to watch the Taylor Swift Eras tour? No. Good night.